Hey guys, this is Josh from the Hobby Bug, and this is episode 4 of our Red Cat Racing Gen 8 pack build series. Today I'm going to be going over with you the interior we chose for the build, as well as updating you on the wheels and tires and the body. Okay, to get started, our interior kit we chose is the Proline Classic Interior Kit. We're going to be doing the vintage style M715 Jeep instead of the modern concept. So we did want to go with a bench seat. I know some of them come with bucket seats, but we like the bench seat and that's kind of what we wanted to do with this build. So that's what we went with. Um, we will show you an updated version of this interior next week when it is all painted and finished up. Uh, for the body, what we've done here is I have showed you the more narrow fender flares on here. Um, but I have cut out the windows so it looks like the windows are rolled down and you can see the interior a little bit better. As you can see, the body here, the bed, has been cut out and if you look closely, you can see that Jeff has started making us a drop bed for this. Uh, we're going to have a drop bed and we're also going to have something in there to cover up the shock towers and the shocks. That is going to be a pretty cool uh, thing. I've not really seen anybody do it before. Uh, but you, you're gonna like that. Um, here's our wheels and tires. These are the G made SRO2 wheels. I did paint them black and wrap them in Proline BF Goodrich KM3 tires with a Proline dual stage foams. Uh, more things I have for the body is some scale accessories. I went with the Racer's Edge scale accessory kit here. It was in the military green color, but I went ahead and color matched them to the Jeep as you've seen on the older M715 Jeeps, most of their, um, their shovels, axes, jerry cans, things like that were color matched. So I went ahead and done that. I also have one of the snorkels off of the Axial Unimog. Um, and I have mocked it up and it looks really good on here. I do still have the film. That's why this stuff isn't mounted yet. Because I want to keep the film on there until I get the bed of it done. Um, but that's kind of where we are now. Uh, we will be doing some more things next week. You, like I say, you will see the interior and maybe a few other things. Uh, but that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Um, I just want to let you all know, if you are anywhere in the area, there will be a Southern Jeep Festival at Greenville Pickens Speedway, September 27th through 29th, and there will be... Um, RC crawling going on put on by Expedition RC and Red Cat September 28th and 29th. There will be a Red Cat booth set up there at the event and we, the Hobby Bug, will be set up right beside of them selling all of the Gen 8s, the Gen 7s, parts and things like that. We will be supporting Red Cat there and uh, as I say we will be doing some vending for them and um, we just look forward to seeing you guys out. Don't forget to check us out on our website at www.thehobbybugrc.com. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Like our video and subscribe to the YouTube channel and get bit by the hobby bug, guys.